Hey guys, Rob from the Off Grid Tiny House. So I'm I broke down and bought this pure sine wave inverter. It's an upgrade from the one I have now at the tiny house because it can barely run my induction hub for long periods of time when I was making the RSO. So it's time for an upgrade. Now there's nothing wrong with my current inverter other than it has its limitations. So this pretty much doubles the output of my current one, which is kind of needed. And uh, pure sine wave, of course. And I'm going to keep my uh, current one as a backup. And hopefully, uh, you know, this is going to be the answer for everything in the future. So all is good. So here is a little list of what's involved with that. Stay tuned.